team and welcome along on another adventure so as you can see got the old fishing gear on i'm out to see if i can't catch a trout or two with my uh brand new rod from tg custom rods i'm so looking forward to getting out and using this finally um yeah i'll throw a bit of a little uh few pictures in here a bit of a video of it it's a beautiful beautiful rod it's been custom made uh, by Tony at TG custom rods and um, I, I picked all the colors out and all the rest of it and then the rest of it was all his magic <laughs> it's a beautiful piece so I'm gonna be putting that through its paces this morning um, also got my new knife that I've just made for myself to actually match my rod so this is a um, Crispy's Kiwi blades knife or CK Blades knife and Kydex sheath. Basically, it's just a little uh, bird and trout knife. Nice little uh, laminate G10 handle. Simple little blade. Uh, should do the bizzo. And in the cool camo colours. So, yeah, I make these to order, guys, if you are keen send me a, a message it just clips in there sits on my vest quite nicely in the kydex sheath so the kydex as well not leather so quite durable and it's just a one-handed operation too easy haha <laughs> gotta love it so yeah so i'm gonna um i'm just down on the ashley river today and i'm just gonna sort of wander upstream and see how we go nice bright and early morning looks like it's gonna be a nice day just using soft baits uh, and yeah wish me luck because <laughs> I'm gonna need it Fish on guys, fish on. <laughs> Mint, all right. See what she weighs. Oh, settle down. Smack on two pound. Oh, does he want to get going? Bleeding quite a bit from the nose. 
There we go. He's off. Oh well. Pearl Olive seems to be the go. But she just uh, took the tail right off that last one, so we'll change over. I'll keep going with what's working. Oh, crispy. That's ugly. Do that again. Nobody likes a kinky bait. Wow. That's better. Lovely. So these little guys nest in the uh, riverbeds up here. Be so, so careful when you're up here because you just cannot see the nests. Unless they're sitting on them. Then you know all about it. <laughs> Oh guys, first impressions of this uh, new rod, ha, it's pretty good, um, it's very accurate, you point where you want to cast and it's got the distance, I'm pretty stoked with the sensitivity of that tip, I can feel that bouncing across the bottom of the uh, stones. Um, yeah, casting's mint. It's not too heavy. I thought it might have been just a tad too heavy, but it's not. It's pretty cool. Um, seem to have matched it up with the reel quite nice. It's just a little uh, Abu Grashi Azata. And I'm pretty stoked. Only the one fish. I've had multiple, multiple fish follow my lure right to the bank and just nothing um, so yeah changed multiple times seemed to be the olive and pearl that got that one earlier she's getting a bit late in the morning now i think i'm pretty much done me dash but thanks for joining me guys it's been a bit of fun it's nice just to get out and try the new rod. So don't forget to uh, like and subscribe if you're enjoying what you're, what you're watching and the content. Leave a comment too, it certainly um, helps my analytics. Uh, YouTube will promote me more if I get more comments and more likes so don't forget to uh, leave a comment on the way out smash that like button if you haven't subscribed hit that bell for uh, more notifications alrighty guys what do you reckon one last one more cast one more cast and then we'll do it <laughs> Alrighty guys, well thanks for joining me, until the next one, happy hunting. <laughs>